Welcome to USMLEFastTrack.com. The section we're going to talk about today is from First Aid for the USMLE Step 1, 2013 Edition. Page 203. What is Type 2 Hypersensitivity Reaction? Type 2 Hypersensitivity Reaction is cytotoxic or antibody-mediated hypersensitivity reaction. In this, IgM or IgG will bind to fixed antigen on enemy cells, leading to the cellular destruction. What are the three different mechanisms of type 2 hypersensitivity? The first mechanism is obstinization, which will lead to phagocytosis and complement activation. In this, basically, the antibodies will tag the pathogen, and that pathogen will then get obstinized and phagocytosed. The second mechanism is the complement-mediated lysis, in which there is formation of the membrane attack complex, and that destroys the cell membrane, killing the pathogen. And the third mechanism is the antibody-dependent cell-mediated cytotoxicity, or ADCC, which is usually due to natural killer cells. In this, what ends up happening is that IgG or IgM antibody will tag the foreign antigen, which would then be killed by natural killer cells. Give an example of type 2 hypersensitivity reaction. An example of type 2 hypersensitivity reaction is incompatible blood transfusion. So basically what would happen in this is that the antibodies will react with the incompatible blood leading to lysis of those cells. What test is used to diagnose type 2 hypersensitivity? The test useful in diagnosing type 2 hypersensitivity is direct and indirect Coombs test to detect the antibodies. For more information on this topic, click on the link in the description section below. For a full USMLE Step 1 review, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com where we help you review the entire first aid for the USMLE Step 1 with high quality videos and hundreds of detailed pictures for a better understanding of the material. So to learn from the best USMLE review book, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com.